Pastor Adam's going to talk today about flow and transformation. So I thought I would invite a guest from our community who is an expert on transforming. Good morning, Zach. Good morning, Sally. Zach, you've been involved in transformations for many years now. Yes, I have. So what perspective can you share with us to help us understand why transformation is important? Well, transformation happens because the situation requires it. Mm -hmm. Very good. So does that mean that we transform to respond to a challenge? That maybe we're not what we could be? Yes, in order for us to continue and grow and serve, we must adjust and change to the current environment, our current situation. So do you think we sometimes get too comfortable to change? Absolutely, we do. So how do you think we can encourage our viewers to embrace change and transformation? I think they can be open to what God will be doing in their lives to change oh. to starting something new. Nice. Like this. Even if it means that they need to leave their comfort level? I think what God wants us to do, we need to change and be open to new things. Zach, we so appreciate your expertise and taking time from your busy schedule to share with us today. So thank you so much for being here. Anytime. Thank you for having me. Or let's roll out. <laughs> when we give God all our pieces, we lay everything before him. He completes us, and sometimes it's in ways we do not expect. Are you ready to be transformed? Are you ready for God to do a new thing in your life? Let's pray. Dear God, help us to see what you would have us be, Father. We get stuck in our ways. We think we have been there and done that, and we limit ourselves. We overthink it. Help us to leave our comfort zone and follow you. In your precious son's name, we pray and all God's children say, amen. Yay, God.